Now that .NET Nuke, our app, and all other resources are ready, let's install the Cloud on Time connector for .NET Nuke module. Navigate to the Code on Time downloads page. Scroll to the bottom of the page. Go ahead and click Download under the .NET Nuke section. Switch back to .NET Nuke. In the sidebar, hover over the gear icon and press Extensions. Press Install Extension. Upload the zip file. Press Next. Accept the license. Our module is now installed. Now that the module has been installed, let's add a page that will be used as an authentication endpoint for the web app. Hover over the content icon and press Pages. Select Add Page. Assign the name Auth Endpoint 1. Make sure the page is not displayed in the menu. Under Permissions, allow all users to view the page. Go ahead and add the page. Drop the page at the end of the sitemap. You will be navigated to the new page. Let's add the module to the new page. In the bottom left corner, press Add Module. Select Cloud on Time Connector. Drop the module in the first placeholder on the page. In the top right corner of the module, click on the gear icon and press Settings. Switch to the Configuration tab. Enter the publicly accessible URL for your app. Copy the client secret. Go ahead and press Update. .NET Nuke has been configured for authentication from our app. We will need to allow authentication from within the app as well. Log in as an administrative user in your app. Switch to the site content page. Create a new record. Select Open Authentication Registration. Select .NET Nuke as your authentication provider. Enter the parameters matching the configuration in .NET Nuke. The client URI will be equal to the endpoint page of your .NET Nuke portal. The redirect URI will be equal to the publicly accessible URL of your app. Enable synchronization of user roles. Go ahead and press Save. Our app is now configured to accept authentications from .NET Nuke. Let's go ahead and sign out to test the functionality.
Let's make sure to log out of .NET Nuke as well. Let's try to log into our app. Notice that a new Login with .NET Nuke button is now available on the login form. Go ahead and press this button. We have been redirected to the login screen of .NET Nuke. Enter your credentials. We have been signed into our app using the credentials of our .NET Nuke account.